In this video, I am conducting the Ensemble Sentire Selvaggi in my own composition, Bad Blood, for piano and five instruments. It's a piece that I wrote in 2001, when we played for the first time at Teatro alla Scala in Milan. We also played this piece more than 20 times in different parts of the world. And then we recorded it for a CD. And that's the way we work with our ensemble. We play the pieces many times by contemporary composers and then we try to put them on record to create a new repertoire of contemporary music. Our new CD, Zingiber, it's out on Cantaloupe Records and it's entirely devoted to Italian composers. Many of them are our friends and we have worked for them for many long years. With a group of contemporary music, you're lucky because you have the opportunity to work directly with the composers that you play, to stimulate their creativity, giving life to projects together. That's why we're always trying to have a personal connection with the composers that we play, and during the years we have forged very strong bonds with some of them. Composers like David Lang, James Macmillan, Philip Glass, Gavin Bryars, and Fabio Vacchi, we play first performance in Italy of their music. They write music for our ensembles and they work with us, giving life to very complex projects, like the first performance of Something Connected with Energy by Michael Nyman at the Festival della Scienza in Genova. Every year we try to produce at least two pieces of musical theater. This way we can reach a new and wide audience. When we stage a new opera, we invite to work with us directors and art directors that we think are on the same wavelength as the composer. And we work real hard to try to match the musical performance and the staging to the same high level of the scores that we choose to perform. Sometimes certain projects are born meeting artists that use different languages. That's why we work with painters, video makers, choreographers, actors, and musicians from the world of jazz and rock. For example, we work with Italian rock star Eugenio Finardi in a project about Vladimir Vysotsky, and this record won a very important award for records in Italy. <laughs> Due, tre, quattro, un po' più svelto, buona lena, grazie, cosa plastica. Sentieri Selvaggi tries to bring contemporary music outside of the traditional concert halls and theaters. We have played in universities, we have played in the square, we have played in art galleries, we also play in the streets. And starting in 2010, we will be grouped in residence at Teatro Elfo Puccini a new cultural center which is devoted to theater, music and contemporary dance. Every year we organize a contemporary music festival with concert, composition masterclass and meetings with musicians, composers, scientists, writers and architects. They talk to the audience trying to explain how music influences their work and vice versa. Starting with our first concert 15 years ago, we had tried to play the music of composers with very different styles and different aesthetics. Our concerts are also very informal. There are no tuxedos, no program notes. We only say a few words before the performance to help the audience understand the music. But the most important things in our concerts are the musicians in the ensemble. 
These are extraordinary musicians who have a lot of enthusiasm for new music. And that's exactly what we have at Satira Salvaggi. We want to bring our enthusiasm and our joy for new music to audiences all over the world. Mm -hmm.